Hibernation is when an animal shelters itself from adverse environmental conditions and sleeps. However, what most people forget is that hibernation is a type of dormancy. In this The Daily Eagle video, we explain what dormancy is and its four types, in addition to mentioning examples of animals that hibernate. Let's get started. Dormancy and its different types. Dormancy is a period in the biological cycle of an organism in which there is a temporary suspension of some activities such as growth, development, and physical activity. The goal of this state is to conserve energy by reducing their metabolic activity. In addition, dormancy is often related to environmental conditions. Now, let's take a look at the four types of dormancy. Diapause. This process is genetically predetermined and very common in insects. Diapause is the prolonged arrest of growth that serves to survive in unfavorable conditions, which is usually between winter and spring. However, there is also another type called embryonic diapause that occurs in the European red deer. The moment in which the embryo implants in the uterus is delayed until the conditions for the birth of the young are favorable. Estivation. This process occurs in response to very hot environmental conditions or in periods of drought. Estivation is very common in invertebrates such as earthworms, snails of the genus Helix, and some fish. Brumation. This process is very common in reptiles and is similar to hibernation, but they differ in the regulation of metabolic processes. Organisms enter a prolonged state of torpor to cope with the cold winter weather conditions. However, during this process, they wake up to drink water and eat some food. In addition, in this process, they can survive sub-zero temperatures. Hibernation. This is the ability certain species have to enter a state of prolonged torpor to cope with the cold weather conditions of winter. The state can last from days to months, and it resembles a hyperthermic state in which the metabolism falls to very low levels to better conserve energy. It also lowers the heart rate and the body temperature, thus concentrating the heat of the vital organs. Before hibernating, animals increase the fat reserves stored in their bodies. In addition, during hibernation, they do not need to drink, urinate, or defecate. However, some species, such as squirrels, wake up periodically to consume reserves of acorns and other nuts that they store to consume during hibernation. Now that you know the four types of dormancy, let's take a look at some examples of animals that hibernate and that sometimes also use other types of dormancy depending on the situation. Brown bear. Pregnant bears are the first to go into hibernation and the last to come out of it. They only come out of hibernation to give birth and care for their young. In contrast, males tend to remain active longer. There are also some families of bears that do not hibernate or hibernate very briefly. This will depend on the amount of fat they have accumulated before winter. Before we continue, let's put you to the test. Do pandas hibernate? A. Yes, just like brown bears. B. Yes, but differently to brown bears. Or C. No, they do not hibernate. The correct answer is C. Unlike brown bears, pandas do not hibernate. When the cold comes around, they go in search for a warmer place and return when winter is over. All right, let's continue with other examples of animals that do hibernate. Frogs. Wood frogs stop breathing and their heart completely stops too. These frogs freeze to the point of forming ice crystals in their blood and survive temperatures that reach minus 20 degrees Celsius. When the warm season arrives, these frogs begin to thaw, managing to breathe again and awaken from their hibernation. European Hedgehog Hedgehogs hibernate from a few weeks to several months depending on the weather. In this process, they decrease their heart rate up to 90%. In addition, they can also optimize their energy if they are in very hot and dry climates. Bats these animals do not hibernate only due to low temperatures, but also due to lack of food. Their hibernation usually lasts 183 days, during which they undergo physiological and metabolic changes, such as a drop in body temperature. In addition, they usually wake up every 10 days to defecate, urinate, or move to a safer place. 
rodents. Marmots, squirrels, and prairie dogs hibernate during the coldest months of the year and can also optimize their energy if the environment is too hot and dry. There are also other pet rodents that hibernate, such as hamsters and gerbils. We hope you enjoyed this video and we'll see you in the next one.